everyone! This is Chris from Gen X Life is Good. I'm here with my day one report on the fasting mimicking diet, do-it-yourself version. So today I had a salad for lunch, romaine lettuce, tomatoes, carrots, cauliflower, and broccoli uh, with a little bit of balsamic vinaigrette. It was a fairly small salad. Um, usually I have something that's a little bit bigger, but it was good, it was tasty. Uh, I was a little hungry this afternoon. Uh, ended up eating some of my snack. I had four steamed potatoes as a snack and I ate half of those. And um, it's actually pretty late now and I'm cooking dinner because I had to wait for my family to be out of the kitchen. Of course they had pasta for dinner. Um, but I was okay. I was really not that hungry. A little hungry this afternoon but towards dinner time I was actually okay. Drank a lot of herbal tea, drank a lot of water. Um, but, you know, now that I'm smelling all the food I'm cooking, I'm actually really looking forward to eating. Let me show you what I'm making. This is a vegetable soup. Um, it's three cups of water with all the vegetables that you saw yesterday that didn't go into the salad. So there's, you know, butternut squash, Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, carrots, um, the celeriac to flavor the soup. So I don't know if you can see that and I can show it to you without spilling it. Um, it's actually a really big portion because uh, it's three cups of water with all these veggies. I don't even know if I can eat all that tonight, but I'll try. And um, then we also have kale with shredded carrots. And it's sautéed in a little coconut oil, and that smells really good. I'm really looking forward to eating this. So today um, I took in 815 calories, or I will have taken in 815 calories once I eat all that. Um, which is less than the Prolon diet recommends. Prolon is uh, 1,090 calories on day one, but of course Prolon is for anyone, right? It's not specific to a particular person, a particular body weight. And looking at the patents, I think it's probably geared to someone who's maybe 180, 200 pounds or so. Um, again, looking at the patents for somebody my size, I cut it down a little bit they're recommending between four and a half and seven calories per pound of body weight. So I adjusted it down from, for me and then I'm also adjusting it down for days two through five. Now in terms of the macronutrients, I'm pretty close to the exact percentages that Dr. Longo recommends. Um, and in terms of micronutrients, I was really surprised. I just looked this up. I am pretty much reaching the macronutrient, sorry, the micronutrients on almost everything except some of the B vitamins. So I'm hitting or exceeding the values for vitamin A, C, for calcium, magnesium, copper, manganese, selenium, vitamins B5 and B6, B9, which is folate, and vitamin K. I am low on vitamins B1, B2, B3, B12, which is understandable because that's not really in plant-based um, foods except if they're fermented so sauerkraut for instance would have that um, there's no vitamin D here and then I'm low on E and I only have a little bit of DHA which is included in my balsamic vinaigrette but overall I'm really pretty happy with how this has turned out and I'm looking forward to eating so I think I'm going to go eat now and then I'll be back and show you what I'm going to be eating tomorrow all right I'll see you in a bit